Hello everybody, this is Gold Glee Gamer one and welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. In this video, we are going to continue going through Angry Aztec. The first thing I'm going to do is collect those red bananas that I saw on the roof of the Llama Temple while I was doing that ring course with the buzzer. And here's another banana medal. And now let's switch to DK. Okay, I'm a little too close. And there's Lanky Kong! But, don't worry, we'll free him also. Now we'll play the bongos and... Wake up, llama! Now is that... I was wondering, is that realistic for a llama sneeze to turn lava into water? Well... I guess there can be only one explanation for why that just happened. Video game logic, I know. <laughs> and by hitting that coconut switch, we have just freed Lanky. Oh, let's pound this switch. And do you know what that switch does? Yes, it opens this door. Dang it. Wait a sec, did I miss one? Yeah, let me check. I guess not.
I have this odd feeling that I definitely missed some. Gotta swing across here. Ha! I knew there were some I missed. Alright, I'm caught up now. Let's move on. And now we finally get to show off Strong Kong. By using Strong Kong, DK is actually invincible, which is good because we actually need that to get through this sand tunnel. And now it's time for a bonus game. Stealthy Snoop. Alright, simply for this game, you don't want to be caught in the light, or you'll lose. Come on. No! Come on, get out of the way. I don't, I don't think it's this way. I think I go this way. <gasps> no! Welcome to bonus stage. Now this proves that this bonus game can be difficult, but in my opinion, it's not the most difficult of them all. Not taking another chance this time. Well, I did it. And by completing that bonus area, a fifth banana porter has uh, appeared. Okay, now that we got that done, it's time to go defeat the boss. with the amount of bananas that he has, we now should have and have enough, enough to open the boss door. Now, as you can see, there's a little dragonfly in the way. Wait, but he stomped on it. Bravo, Diddy! Oh, what's that behind him? Why, it happens to be our next boss, Dogadon.
Dogadon will, will fire a, a certain amount of fireball. And then once he pauses, hit him with a TNT barrel. In my opinion, I believe this is like the easiest boss battle in the game. All it, all it takes is three hits, and, and dodging these fireballs are very easy to do. Alright, one more hit will do it. Alright, Diddy, this one's for the win. Done. And just like that, we got boss key number two. Alright, but uh, we're not going to get out of here just yet. Alright, let's welcome Lanky into the game. And Lanky gets the Grape Shooter. And now let's switch to Tiny. Yes, I know there are some purple bananas there, but we're not going to grab them yet. And he gets the feather bow. All right, now let's go see Cranky. And Tiny gets. Mini Monkey! Lanky gets the orang stand. Now let's work our way out of here. And by shooting those two coconut switches, another door opens. 
Oh, and as you can see, there's the cast flat that's holding DK's blueprint. We're gonna get that too. Can't knock me off while I'm using Strong Kong, Casplat. And we got the blueprint. Let's get out of here. And here's boss key number two to K Lumsey's cage. <laughs> this time K Lumsey made a platform rise, opened the door to the third world. And also the fourth world. Right. But we're not going to go in the fourth world till much, much later. there. Thank you. Now these finds actually take you to the um, to Snide's HQ here on the overworld. But we're gonna jump down for a second and we're gonna shoot this coconut switch to get a golden banana. All right, now let's begin the climb again. up here, we will find Banana Porter 4 and the entrance to the third world. And this time, we need 15 golden bananas to get inside. Well, that's good, because we have 16. Admit, I don't really get the point of this cutscene anyway. Alright. 
Now it's time to begin the third world, Frantic Factory. And there's Chunky Kong. His cell is actually hanging in the air. But we'll get him out too. Which we just hit, it opens this door. All right, now we climb down here. the machine but we're not going to do anything here for the moment and now we made it to the room where chunky is prisoner but but dk can't free him oh, hey while we're here let's do the baboon blast course by going through that star. A lever appears in front of an arcade game, but which we're actually going to play much, much later. And that switch we just hit opens those gates. All right. Now let's get Lanky out, because he's the only one that can free Chunky. And by hitting that switch, Chunky drops to the ground. Now let's get everyone caught up on shopping before we get out of here. Lanky gets Baboon Balloon. <laughs> and this time Lanky gets Trombone Tremor. Switch to tiny. And 
this time, Tiny gets Ponytail Twirl, which is kind of like Dixie Helicopter Spin. I guess they didn't want to repeat the same title for this game. This time, Tiny gets Saxophone Slam! Alright, Chunky, let's get you in the game. Now, since Chunky was the last to be freed, he actually gets two potions for his first visit. Now Chunky gets Triangle Trample. gets Gorilla Grab. Oh, wait a second. This time, Diddy gets Simeon Spring. All right, now let's get out of here. I'm going to stop the video here. So until next time, this is Gold Glee Gamer 1. Later, folks.